יום שישי, השעון כבר מראה צהריים, והשמש צועקת לקום, מתארגן, מתלבש מצחצח שיניים, לוקח לי קטן, אני כמעט מוכן, היום הולכים לים. ברדיו הום קולטום נזכר שלא אכלתי כלום. אני חונה שנייה מגיע. בים שישי בצהריים, כל שבוע זה רק פירות מכות ושמיים. כולם זרוקים כאן על החול, ואת עוברת כמו בשיר. אם בגד ים זעיר, אולי הכי יפה בעיר. הראש קצת השעון כבר מראה בין ארבעים והשמש צוללת לאט מתקפל ושוטף את החול ברגליים ואת ממש ממול מנסה להיות קצת קול ואת הלב רק להרגיע מתקרבת בחיוך לחוץ מרגיש חסוך סליחה לאן אתה מגיע כולם זרוקים שם בים שישי בצהריים כל שבוע בישן את חייכנית, וזה בדיוק מה שאת אוהבת. אושר מתקרב, הצלחת להתגנב. אור שלא עוזב, הוא מתגלה בחושך, בכל קצוות תבל, מי שהוא מסתכל, אומר תודה לאל, על אהבת אמת, איך שאת רוקדת, גם הלב שלי רוקד איתנו. מים רבים לא יכבו את האש שלנו. רוצה להתמכר לטוב שמתגבר 
אם הלב אומר, בטח שהוא יודע, תכף נתעורר לניגון אחר. לא צריך יותר, יש עוד מסע שלם. איך שאת רוקדת, גם הכוכבים רוקדים איתנו. בואי נרוץ רחוק, תני לי רק כמה דקות להיזכר במקומות שאז היינו ילדים לא פחדנו סתם לחיות, בלי המינוס הצרות בלי לתלות את התקוות, כמו כביסה על חבלים כמו איזה שני משוגעים בחוף שמרנו רגעים בלב, שתינו את הנוף ואת היית יפה כמו פרח שאסור היה לקטוף רציתי רק לקטוף אותך רציתי לקטוף כמו איזה שני משוגעים בחוף שמרנו רגעים בלב שתינו את הנוף ואת היית יפה כמו פרח שאסור היה לקטוף רציתי רק לקטוף אותך רציתי לקטוף כמו איזה שני משוגעים עם יחפות, מזיכרונות ואכזבות שאז רצינו לשחרר כמעט ויתרנו על עצמנו נברח רחוק מהשגרה כמו אז שהסתפקנו באושר הפשוט כמו איזה שני משוגעים בחוף שמרנו רגעים בלב, שתינו את הנוף ואת היית יפה כמו פרח שאסור היה לקטוף רציתי רק לקטוף אותך, רציתי לקטוף כמו איזה שני משוגעים בחוף שמרנו רגעים בלב, שתינו את הנוף ואת היית יפה כמו פרח שאסור היה לקטוף רציתי רק לקטוף אותך, רציתי לקטוף כמו איזה שני משוגעים
חיכית לי ואני תמיד חיכיתי לך והנה היום הזה הגיע עכשיו מבטיח שאף פעם לא תהי לבד ואם פתאום תעלמי אחכה כל הלילה ואלחש בתפילה שאלי תחזרי ואם תבואי אליי נשאר כל הלילה ואלחש לך מילים שתדעי שאני שלך ובבוקר תראי נשאר ביחד הולכים את הדרך הזו לתמיד יד ביד ואם תבואי אליי נשאר כל הלילה ואלחש לך מילים שתדעי שאני שלך חיכית לי ואני תמיד חיכיתי לך והנה היום הזה הגיע עכשיו מבטיח שאף פעם לא תהי לבד ואם פתאום תעלמי אחכה כל הלילה ואלחש בתפילה שאלי תחזקי ואם תבואי Ladies and gentlemen, please take your virtual seats. This evening's Tree of Life virtual gala, honoring Raquel and Michael Haas, will commence in two minutes. השעון כבר מראה צהריים והשמש צועקת לקום, מתארגן מתלבש מצחצח שיניים לוקח לי קטן, אני כמעט מוכן היום הולכים לים ברדיו הום קולטום נזכר שלא אכלתי כלום אני חונה שנייה מגיע בצהריים, כל שבוע זה רק פירות מכות ושמיים, כולם זרוקים כאן על החול, ואת עוברת כמו בשיר, עם בגד ים זעיר, אולי הכי יפה בעיר. הראש קצת מסתובב, הלב מרגיש רעב, פירות שמש זה שילוב Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jewish National Fund USA Northern Ohio President and Co-Chair of this evening Tree of Life virtual event, Rebecca Barshane. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct pleasure to welcome you to our Cleveland virtual Tree of Life celebration. 
I want to extend a mazel tov to our honorees, Raquel and Michael Haas, a most deserving couple. Their devotion to our community in Israel is boundless. They truly deserve this recognition and we are proud to recognize them. We would have preferred to honor you in person and we are grateful for your flexibility. To me, it shows your true values, that you're committed to Israel by any and all means, even if it means a little less fun for all of us. We are coming together in a different way this year. We remain united in our love and support for the land of Israel and for the strength of Jewish people worldwide. Over the past weeks, hundreds of rockets targeted communities throughout Israel, including Jerusalem and communities in the South. Families sitting down for dinner, parents taking their children to school, professionals on Zoom meetings, all finding themselves in the crosshairs of terrorists. Thanks to you, Jewish National Fund USA's philanthropic investments have ensured Israel's Southern communities are prepared for the worst while hoping for the best. JNF USA resilience centers in Eshkol, Ramat HaNegev, and Sha'ar HaNegev have swung into action. Our fortified indoor playground in Sderot and Children's Protected Kingdom in Eshkol are there to keep children safe. The newly completed Animal Therapy Center in Sderot is preparing to help those affected by the current situation. And we continue to support local firefighters with fire trucks, wagons, and stations, among many other initiatives. All are truly vital and literally life-saving resources for these regions every day. Before we begin, I want to thank someone very special. I want to thank you. By joining us this evening and through your contribution, you are cultivating the greatest story ever told. It is a story that began thousands of years ago and continues to evolve. Today, we come together to write the next chapter in our history. Many people do not realize that Jewish National Fund USA is an organization led by volunteer lay leaders. Every major philanthropic investment that we make in Israel is guided by them. With that in mind, I would like to thank our board members. You've guided me with knowledge and support through Zoom after Zoom, your devotion never wavered. I want to give a special shout out to our past presidents for their leadership, guidance, and vision. Barry Feldman, Noreen Koppelman Goldstein, Michael Jacobson, Chuck Whitehill, and Bart Bukatz. When you become a JNF USA lay leader, you do not just invest your philanthropic dollars, you also invest your time and energy in creating a better future for the land and people of Israel. Today's event would also not be possible without the generous support of our sponsors. I would just like to thank all of our sponsors for their generous support of tonight's Tree of Life. We asked and you gave. Kol HaKavod. On top of all the work we ordinarily do to build communities, assist the disabled, promote water-saving technology, and take care of the environment, JNF USA has also been supporting the emergency needs of Israelis during the pandemic. This includes getting food to the hungry, supplying technologies for students working remotely, supporting employees and employers dealing with the changing demands, and even finding volunteers to harvest crops due to a shortage of labor. As of last fall, approximately 32,000 volunteers in 82 communities throughout the Galilee and Negev had distributed food and supplies to the elderly and individuals in need. They've picked up groceries and medicine for those unable to leave their homes. They're running call centers so those in need can access information and help. And they've performed wellness calls for all the elderly members of their communities, including Holocaust survivors. In total, over 400,000 lives have been impacted through our incredible initiatives. As Israel's thriving tourism industry came to a halt, we launched our online mitzvah marketplace and JNF store to bring Israeli small businesses into your homes and hearts. To support Israel's struggling tour guides, we also launched virtual tours to Israel. Without any advertising, we have brought over 6,000 people to Israel virtually. Hopefully, we will all soon have the opportunity to travel to Israel in person. For now, I invite you to sit back and enjoy the evening. From my heart to yours, thank you for helping our beloved Israel. Ladies and gentlemen, Please welcome Cantor Aron Schiffman of B'nai Jeshurun. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light What so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight, all the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rockets red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night. 
that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star spangle banner yet wide for the land of the free and the home of the brave. Kolopaneva penima nefesh yehudi omiya ulefat emizra kadima ayin letzion sofia Od lo adatik vatenu, adatik vat shnot al paim li yadam hoshi ve'artenu ve'retzion virushalai. Liyodam hoshi be'yarteinu v'yaretzion Yerushalayim. When we are doubted, we excel. When people say it can't be done, we do the impossible. When we are surrounded by hatred, we choose love. It began as a dream that one day the Jewish people will again have a home. That vision became a reality. This is Israel. This is Zionism. This is Jewish National Fund USA. It's time to write the next chapter in the Zionist story. Travel the country and you'll see it's happening. A renaissance in the desert. Coexistence in the Galilee. Synagogues, mosques, and churches. Ancient traditions in a modern land. Diversity. Inclusion. Employment. This is Israel. This is Zionism. This is Jewish National Fund USA. Zionism is starting a new community on barren desert plains. It's growing vegetables where there's no rain. It's solving environmental problems, and it's sharing our expertise with the world. Nothing is easy. Things don't always go our way. When we are attacked, we come back stronger. Whether the world is with us or against us, we remember who we are, and we teach it to our children. Whatever challenges come our way, Zionism ensures that we are never alone. When we remember that we always have each other, nothing can stand in our way. Let's build a better world together. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our Tree of Life Virtual Gala co-chairs, Rebecca Barshane, Bart Bukatz, Barry Feldman, Michael Jacobson, and Chuck Whitehill. Good evening and welcome. We are your chairs for the Tree of Life event this evening. We have a very special message for you. Israel is your land, Israel is my land, more than blue boxes, Higher than the tree stand, the Culinary Institute in the Galilee. JNF is there for you and me. We found Chalutza and indoor playgrounds. With your donation, the children we surround, more help from everyone is what we need now. JNF is there for you and me. 
So many programs you want to see. Go on the website and donate happily. Go on a mission, hop on the bus and see. JNF is there for you and me. Upcoming projects we need from you. Beersheba Campus, Lidor Vador, our Zionist village will help the world to see. JNF is there for you and me. Israel is your land, Israel is my land. More than blue boxes, higher than the tree stand. Please donate generously and join our family. JNF is there for you and me. People support Jewish National Fund USA for many reasons. They may be drawn to our work supporting people with disabilities. They may be inspired by the thousands of teens and young people who have found their lifelong connection to Israel through Jewish National Fund's USA Zionist educational programming or at our high school in Israel. Or they may be inspired by our work supporting critical agriculture R&D that is helping farmers around the world become more productive and more sustainable. We need to join in our efforts to make our Jewish world a stronger place. Raquel, you are the definition of a good person, an excellent daughter always helping others. One story comes to mind when you helped a young boy from a broken home get into Mizraki after he received a scholarship from Mandel. You are a beautiful painter who helps others using your good eye for color. You are a loving asset to the Haas family and our community. Michael, with all your success as an international real estate attorney, you are an excellent son, brother, husband, parent, and friend to many. You are never afraid to get your hands dirty, whether gardening or changing diapers when your kids were young. Lana and I have enjoyed the many meals we have shared with your family at your parents' home. Thank you for making us feel so welcome. Michael and Raquel, may you continue to go from strength to strength. By now, you should have received a text message, an email with instructions on how to donate today to support Israel's future tomorrow. You can also make a gift at jnf.org. Let us take a moment now to make our commitment to support the land and people of Israel. Lidor Vador, from generation to generation, to my grandparents and parents who traveled with me many times to Israel since age 10, they are smiling down upon me for the work that I am continuing on their behalf for our Jewish heritage. It is my opportunity and yours to follow in their footsteps to continue the great work that they have done for the growth and success of Israel and her people. Am Yisroel Chai. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, this is Russell Robinson, Chief Executive Officer of Jewish National Fund. You know, in 23 years, I have been in Cleveland quite often, and I've met so many great people. And it's one of those communities that you know as world-renowned, a great Jewish community. And having Raquel and Michael as our honorees tonight only adds to it for today and for tomorrow. First, thank you. Thank you very much for standing up and saying, we are here. We are here with the people of Israel, not just now. We have been there and we'll be there tomorrow because that's the story of the Jewish National Fund. We are the top organization for Zionist education, connecting people from birth to boardroom, bringing that fourth grader along from the time they buy a tree certificate and working with them to having them as future Tree of Life honorees and as board members. And Raquel and Michael, you exemplify that as leadership, as philanthropists, people who make a difference and have people follow you. You're busy. You're busy in your philanthropic and volunteer world, in being a lawyer, in traveling, 
but you're never too busy to stand up and say, this is a moment where it's time for us to be counted. And there is no greater moment than today. Today, that we have to shout from the rooftops that we are Zionists. We have to shout from the rooftops, we are Jews and we are here. And we are going to keep building that Jewish community, the Jewish community in Cleveland, in the United States, and we're connecting to the land and people of Israel. And what better people to be working with than our friends in Cleveland, our leaders in Cleveland, our Northern Ohio president, Rebecca Bar Shane, our past presidents, Bart Bukatz and Barry Feldman, Noreen Koppelman Goldstein, Michael Jacobson, and Chuck Whitehill. Thank you for being my friends. Thank you for being leaders and being the chairman in tonight's dinner. You make a difference every day. Thank you. So, ladies and gentlemen, join me in wishing a hearty mazel tov to Raquel and Michael Haas. Thank you for being our Tree of Life honorees tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome previous Jewish National Fund USA Tree of Life Award recipients, Ida and Erwin Haber. As past honorees of the Tree of Life Award, Ida and I were deeply honored when Raquel and Michael asked us to introduce them as this year's recipients. In 2018, when we were asked by Margaret Singerman and Barry Feldman to receive such an honor, it touched our souls in such a way that it is actually difficult to express into words how powerful this recognition is. And when Raquel and Michael agreed to receive such prestigious recognition from the Jewish National Fund USA, we knew that they were just as touched as we were. So where do we begin to attempt to express all the good that Raquel and Michael have done for their family, their friends, and the Jewish community? Most of you probably don't know how very much they are both involved in extremely important causes that touch everyone in one way or another. Michael is a highly successful attorney at Latham and Watkins and is the global co-chair of the firm's real estate practice. He represents private equity firms, real estate asset managers, and public and private real estate companies in sophisticated market-defining transactions. He is regularly recognized as, as an accomplished practitioner in his field, including recognition by the Legal 500 US and Chambers USA. Michael plays an extremely active leadership role in numerous community organizations and nonprofits. Today, he currently serves on the board of the very prestigious Basser Leadership Council for the Basser Center for BRCA at Penn Medicine's Abramson Cancer Center. He is extremely committed to Jewish causes, both domestically and in Israel. And he also serves on one of the Jewish Federation's cabinets. In fact, he was the first Agnon student of the Agnon Jewish Day School, now the Joseph and Florence Mandel Jewish Day School, to become the president of the board. And when Michael is asked to get involved in something, the word no is not in his vocabulary. He is always willing to lend his time and provide much needed resources to improve on whatever needs to be improved upon and is always up to the challenge. Raquel has many accomplishments as well. And I don't want to embarrass her, but I, but I will take this opportunity to name a few. And believe me, there are many, many more. She is also extremely involved with the Basser Center at Penn Medicine's Abramson Cancer Center and volunteers her time at the Juvenile Detention Center for 15 to 17 year old boys and is also actively involved at the Jewish Federation. I'm gonna stop there, but the list is much longer for both Michael and Raquel. It's a delight to have got to know you and Yasha Koch to both of you as this year's recipients of the Tree of Life Award. Our beautiful relationship with Raquel and Michael has only developed recently, but depth of our feelings towards them suggests it has been decades in the making. We know the intense health challenge that struck their family years ago, and yet when I would see them out, they always had a smile on their faces no matter what Raquel was going through. Raquel showed everyone how to be positive and strong during her time of adversity. Michael would always be kind to address how Raquel was doing whenever he was asked. 
When Raquel and I were asked to co-chair the Agna Mandel Jewish Day School's 50th Anniversary Gala, for me, it was immediate friendship at first sight. I have even said to Raquel, where have you been all my life? Like Erwin said, if you want something done, you go to the Hasses. Some people are just sizzle with no steak. Raquel and Michael are the sizzle with the steak. Erwin and I always enjoy our time together over dinners and a few drinks and meaningful conversations with laughter. Fun, sensitive, and sincere people the Hasses are. Everyone just loves the two of you. Before I close, I want to say one more thing that supersedes everything that we just mentioned today. Alex and Kyle, and even the dog Stanley, you are mom and dad's everything. You are so blessed to have the honor of calling them mom and dad. So, it is our humble pleasure and honor to introduce this year's recipients of the Tree of Life Award, the highest humanitarian award given by the JNF, our dear friends, Raquel and Michael Haas. Mazel tov on such a remarkable recognition to the two remarkable people. Good evening. Raquel and I are overwhelmed and grateful to receive this honor from Jewish National Fund USA. When we see our names in conjunction with past recipients, we certainly don't consider ourselves worthy of this award, but we are fervently committed to the tenets of faith that JNF embodies and are humbled to be listed in the company of such prior honorees and luminaries. It has been said that you are judged by the company you keep. Assuming that fact is true, this recognition is even more extraordinary to both Raquel and me and our family. When Raquel and I first met, we quickly realized that we both had a deep connection and mutual love for Israel. We knew that Eretz Yisrael and Klal Yisrael would be woven through the fabric of our family. We would imbue our love and connection for Israel to our children, Kyle and Alexandra. We would teach them about the deep relationship that the Jewish people have with the land of Israel. We would teach them that a secure Israel, able to coexist peacefully with its neighbors, is important to our Jewish continuity and to world peace. We've been incredibly fortunate to have traveled to Israel several times with our children. As two people who care deeply about the connection between the United States and Israel, it was astonishing to be able to witness Kyle and Alex's initial aha moment, connecting their Jewish studies from the classroom to a vibrant, high-tech, ancient, and yet modern land of Israel. I know that sounds like a dichotomy, which is precisely what it is, and yet it works. Their connection is forever sealed with their hearts and their minds to their homeland. There are endless practical uses to all the science and technology that Israel exports to the world from its brain trusts. We have witnessed with our own eyes desalination plants producing water in the desert. We have seen this water get recycled from drinking water to agricultural water. What Israel learns, it shares with the world. Through JNF USA, we have been able to help Israel fulfill its promise as a light unto nations. Our philanthropic investments help farmers from developing countries in Asia and Africa travel to Israel to learn cutting edge sustainable farming practices that they can then implement in their own native countries. We also take pride in the fact that JNF has been a trusted partner of Israel in solving its water crisis. Today, Israel leads the world in water recycling. As we near the end of this global pandemic, we take great pride in the support that JNF has provided to Israel's most vulnerable. JNF has been on the ground delivering meals to the elderly and providing assistance to the disabled. Raquel and I would like to take this opportunity to thank Mindy Feigenbaum and the entire staff at JNF for all of their help in planning tonight's event and ensuring its success. We'd like to thank our friends and family who generously supported us tonight. Lastly, we'd like to thank our children, Kyle and Alex, who are now continuing in our footsteps of advocating and supporting Israel, each in their own way. JNF USA acts as an intermediary between Israel and Jews around the world 
that has allowed two people from Cleveland to feel like we made a small impact on Israel and the Jewish world. We thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we just heard that the doors to the main room featuring this evening's entertainment are now open. In just a few minutes, we'll join thousands of other passionate supporters of Jewish National Fund USA in Israel. So sit back and relax as we virtually welcome you into the main room. <laughs> 